10 square meters of the internal space of this car, perhaps, are able to atone for all its possible shortcomings. However, this did not stop us from testing the strength of the second generation pilot with mileage, reviews of which in the networks are diametrically opposed. In short, the details in the studio. Replacing the rear wheel bearings after 100,000 kilometers. The outer CV joints of the front axle shafts can crunch after 150 to 200,000 kilometers. The rear springs are guaranteed to sag after 200,000 kilometers, which will be noticeable on the wheels, which become a house. The steering rack knocks at 60 to 100,000 kilometers. Transmission. The cardan shaft bearing is already worn out after 100,000 kilometers. This is evidenced by noise and vibration. Replacement assembly with cardan, up to 120,000 rubles. But you can only replace the bearing for 8,000 rubles. Changing the oil in the rear differential is required every 15,000 kilometers. Engine. After 100,000 kilometers, oil flows from under the cylinder deactivation unit, which, getting on the generator, disables it. Another problem is the neutralizer. When it breaks down, it delegates ceramic chips to the cylinders, which leads to scuffing in the cylinders. And then the replacement of the engine is inevitable. Body. Owners unanimously admit that the car's paintwork is thin and weak. Many people complain about sweaty taillights. After 60,000 kilometers, the front optics become cloudy. However, this does not happen on all machines. But the chrome from the body lining climbs regularly. Corrosion was noticed on the tailgate, from which the button unlocking it refuses. Electrician. Of course, there were no electrical failures. Many complain about weak, native batteries that fail already in the second year of service. After 150,000 kilometers, the heater motor may make noise. The problem will be eliminated by 5,000 rubles. Well, a commonplace, leaking headlight washer nozzles. Unpleasant, but easily solved. 